Great find this is the Kosher Wine Review. I'm Yoshua Worth. And today we're going to head to, uh, what's that place called again? Pravda. A la Carme Yosef Winery. Coming in at 13.9% alcohol. This is the new Quadro. And Quadro is a blend of Cabernet Franc, Merlot, Shiraz, and Cabernet Sauvignon. 12 months in oak barrels. And I like the fact that some people use their oak for their structure and their power, and other people use it for accenting. He's in more of an accenting, more of a uh, French, more of a touching the barrel, more to mature the style of whatever they're wanting to present through the expression of the wine. And I've never tasted or smelled this, which is my favorite in wine tasting. Straight from off the cuff. Mild earth. Accenting wood. A little bit of spicy herbs. Not not field herbs, but um real dense clusters of blackberries just before going jammy. Not quite jammy. A little more restrained and uh, put together. Yeah, dark fruit. After it's airing out, it's getting a little jammier. Let's taste it. Lachaim bracha. Baruch atam lachaim. I already said a bracha. Baruch shem kuvah marcos amalad. Lachaim. That's funny. Hmm. A little bit woody tannin, still a little bit creamy, a little sweet on the tannin, dry wine, you definitely get the oak. Present acid on this wine actually. It's like dark fruits and grapefruits with that acid. The herbs are a little bit softer on the finish. This would be for like mushroom dishes. Um, also put it together with some very herbaceous soups. Uh, not overly fatty as well, even though the acid's present. And for Katie Mahal's, they want some wine with some structure. First Mahusha wine from Bravdo. 2011 Carmen Yosef Winery Quadro. Again, a blend of Cabernet Franc, Cap Merlot, Merlot, Shiraz, and Cabernet Sauvignon. Fruity, acidic, mild oak. Interesting wine. I'm going to see how this wine matures. We'll check it out next year. Mio Shulworth, live at the Grapevine. This is the Kosher Wine Review. Chaim.